Oh, I'm hardcore. Look at me. I'm right around a circle. I'm hardcore. Look, I'm stage diving. Hey, this is Mark Prendel here at markprendel.com. Today's album is Flag of Democracy. Shatter Your Day. It's the first album for FOD. You can't actually see the F because this used to be owned by a, uh, a college radio station. Jim Laxo's brother worked at this college radio station. He gave this album to Jim, Jim gave it to me. Because I like hardcore. You know how much I like hardcore? Check this out. Oh, wait, oh, wait. Uh, yeah, so. Let's try another song. Stage dive! That's pretty exciting. Uh, basically, hardcore punk was really great until about 1986. This album came out in 1986. After 86, it got a little rougher, you know? Like NYHC turned into metal, really slow, boring metal. Uh, and then shortly thereafter, I guess Green Day came out. Bad Religion kind of slicked it all up in 88. And their sound was popular. The really slicked up hardcore sound. Which is fine when the songs are good, but... I mean, like AFI has some good songs, for example, but... Basically, for insane underground hardcore fun, you're gonna must stick to 86 or earlier. I mean, I'm not arguing that Flag of Democracy is like one of the best hardcore bands ever. I'm just saying, if you like hardcore, you should go on the internet and check out blog sites like uh, Punk Not Profit. Uh, there are a bunch, but you know, start there. These guys have a lot of old, rare hardcore albums that you can download really quickly. And a lot of it is really great stuff. I don't know if you can hear this, the way I've positioned it today. Usually I face the other way. But, um, Flag of Democracy, you may have heard of them as FOD from the Dead Milkman song, Nutrition. At the end they go, if I eat all my something food, mom will let me go out and see the hardcore show and see FOD or something like that. But, what happened with Flag of Democracy, unfortunately, is they quickly turned to shit. Well, I shouldn't say that, that's not nice. Their next album is called 23, and I recall liking that one too. It was from 1988. But then, their third album, from 1990, called Down With People, is a complete piece of shit. Like, I can't even tell you how bad that album is. And they kept going after that, but I didn't buy any more. Uh, they're on, they were on Buy Our Records. Another great band on Buy Our Records you might want to check out is Adrenaline OD, or AOD. Uh, so there's AOD, FOD, there's of course MOD, there's SOD, there's a band called POD, but I don't think they're punk. Hang on. And if you don't like hardcore, then this, you know, then check this out. Oi! X's on the hands. Also, it amazes me how many people don't realize this. This black flag thing, the bars, that's a flag, okay? That's it, like a flag blowing in the wind. It's not just four bars. It's a flag blowing in the wind, you see it? So that's what's up with that. Uh, also an interesting thing about albums is sometimes they have lyric sheets inside. And uh, another interesting thing about albums is sometimes they have, uh, you can put your camera inside them and 